Welcome everybody. I am going to, this is my first video that I'm filming for the night. Um, I'm going to film my list of books that I plan to read in the month of October. I will be doing two challenges and also just reading a bunch of books at the same time. And uh, let me get started. So the first thing I want to read is One Dark Throne. I just got a few pages in already. I started it last month. I want to get through it because I just finished the first book. So One Dark Throne. Then I plan to read The List. Um, it is for I'm going to create a book challenge. And I have... If one of the challenges is pick a book that you think is going to have a trick ending or a treat ending. So I think it's going to have a, a, a treat ending, like a sweet ending, considering the content of this book. I'm going into it blind, so I don't know what's going to go on with that one. Another challenge I have for my reading challenge is to read a book with the word storm in the title or with the storm in a book. Um, luckily this book has storm in the title and it deals with the storm. I'm going to reread The Perfect Storm. Uh, whenever I think of Halloween I always think of like storms and thunderstorms and stuff like that. So Perfect Storm, I'll read that one for the challenge too. Then one of my other challenges is to read a book that takes place during Halloween or has Halloween in it and I'm just going to read the first half of this book because I read the last half back when Big Tubathon was going on so I'm going to read Hocus Pocus and if it has a challenge I mean if it if a book that you're reading that deals with Halloween has a movie adaption watch it too so I'm going to be watching Hocus Pocus and reading Hocus Pocus this month. Then another challenge I have too um, is read a book that has Halloween themed recipes or could be adapted for Halloween. So I always think of Halloween whenever I think of Harry Potter. So I'm going to read the book, pick a few recipes I like, and then cook them. So. Harry Potter, the unofficial cookbook. And then the last challenge is for my reading challenge is I want to read a book that deals with like uh, Halloween creatures. So, uh, for instance, you could do werewolf, you could do zombie, you could do witch, vampire. So I'm going to go with Wicked. For this one. I've wanted to read Wicked for a while so I'm gonna go with Wicked for that. And then that's the end of that and then I'm gonna be doing the challenge by Lala which is the Spookathon. So um, I need to read a book that's a thriller so I'm gonna go with the girl with the dragon tattoo. Um, so I'll read this. I've wanted, been wanting to read this one for a while and it's been on my shelf forever. And I have the other ones too. So Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. Then a book with purple on the cover. So I'm going to go with Gamer Girl and it's got purple right here. See? So it's got purple. So I'll read Gamer Girl. And then a book that doesn't take place in this time period. I'm going to read Ready Player One. It takes place in 2044. That's like a few years from now. So I'll read Ready Player One. Uh, read a book with pictures in it. So, I always like an excuse to read a good comic. Um, I'm going to go with Avatar Last Airbender, The Lost Adventures. I always love to reread this. So, I'll go with that. 
And then read a book with a spooky, um, like a spooky word in it. And I always think the dark is very spooky, but that's just me. So I'm going to go with Two Dark Rains. And uh, that's the last one for the challenge here. And then um, I'm going to read one more book. It's on my uh, iPad right now, but it's charging over there. And I'm going to read Save. I'm going to try to read Save the Date. So that's it for the books that I plan to read for October. I hope I can get to all of them. Um, thank you so much for watching. And uh, I will be coming out with the challenge very soon for my Halloween challenge. It's going to go, well, I'm going to do it for myself. If you want to join me, you can if you want to. I'm going to plan to do it from October 26th to November 1st. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Love you guys. Bye.